What is up everybody, Intense Gamer from TechTunes here, and today I'm going to be showing you a unlimited, practically unlimited skill point. I wouldn't say it's a glitch, I'm just going to call it a glitch, because it's pretty darn cool. So the first step is you're going to want to go ahead and get a BMW M6 Coupe Forza Edition. Now, the reason that you want the Forza Edition is because it comes with a drift skills boost, uh, and that'll be useful for the tutorial. So get one, I don't care how you do it, uh, you can go to the auction house and bid on one. I was gonna say, or you could find one from just the buy car section, but you can only get it from the auction house because you cannot buy Forza Editions from the garage. So anyways, you're gonna wanna go ahead and get one of these, then you're gonna go to upgrades and tuning, and then you're gonna click find new tunes, and then you're gonna click search and search Fade to black CF. This uh, Drift Mania one will show up. Select it and hit download and install. So now you have the proper car and the proper tune. So the next step is you're going to want to go ahead and go to this spot on the map. It's right above Fortune Island. It's uh, right by Bamber Pinewood Trail, just to the side of it. Uh, I'm going to go and fast travel, but uh, right here is where you want to drive. So once you arrive here, it should look something like this. Uh, now, I do recommend don't use a steering wheel for this unless if you're really good at drifting. But it is 10 times easier using a controller or a keyboard and mouse. And then you're basically just going to want to drift. And if you drift, it will bank up your points. And you want to get the multiplier to times 7. And you want to get your points to 70,000. So let's just do that. Also, something to mention is, in a second when I'm done this, I'll show you all the skill points you can get for this car and the ones you want to get to make the uh, skill point grinding way better. Once you hit the end like this, you're just going to turn around, and as you see, I'm not doing anything, and it's still banking up. I would recommend stopping at around 70,000, because there is a cap to the points, and it's 510,000. So if you do the math, 7 times 73,000 is 500,000. So you're just going to want to wait when it hits 7 times a multiplier. And there you go. You got 512,000 points, which will equal up to 10 skill points. Now you can go to your car mastery and check that I have 41 available skill points. Now these are all the things I recommend to get uh, for this car. You have, you basically just need this one to get all the other ones. 10% more influence skills. Car builds its skill multiplier much faster when a skill song is played. Your car's near-miss skills are increased. You don't really need that one because you're not going to be near-missing anything. Wreckage skills, that's a really good one. Because as you saw when I did that, I knocked into those like little yellow things. So yeah. Definitely do this. Also this. And this. And this. And this. And also this. Once all of these are done, uh, then your car will be at its maximum potential for doing this glitch. That is how I get 10 skill points in 2 minutes in Forza Horizon 4. Now here's how to convert them to credits. Now if you have extra skill points and you want to know how to convert them to credits, go to your auction house, search cars, find MG, and search for the MG MGB. Now what you're going to want to look for is people who have stock paint, stock tune, and don't buy one. Yes, see Waffles, he's probably selling multiple, which means they are doing the same thing that I'm doing. Uh, I'm going to go ahead and buy this one out, if I can, if somebody already hasn't bought it out. Here we go, buy out successful. You won the MGMGB. Now, it's, just, it's kind of a gamble. So what you're looking for is for the car mastery to be completely clean. And I'll show you why in a second. Go ahead and get in the car. And you're going to look in the Cars tab and to see if the mastery is 0 out of 16. So I did get unlucky. That means people are doing the exact same thing I am doing. But what you're going to basically want to look for is an MGMGB that is a stock mastery. Because that means you get a wheel spin if you claim this with your points. You get 100,000 credits. Also on to another 200,000 credits. But the good thing is if you get one that has uh, 6 like that has car mastery perks already already done you can go to your house go to auction house hit start auction and then auction this and 
I'm a dummy. I'm in the car. I can't auction something I'm in. One sec, let me just go into my Lamborghini. I'm GMGB and I actually have two that I can auction. Uh, but this is my new one that I found that already has the skill points enabled so it won't work. So you could just re-auction it and you'll get, nine times out of ten, the same amount of money back. I recommend doing it for 12 hours. You can do it for one hour. Uh, because 9 10 out of 10, it's going to get bought even if you do it for one hour. Because so many other people are doing this. So that's it for this tutorial. If you like this video, make sure to leave a like and subscribe. And stay tuned with noties on. Because we were probably, we were, we're probably going to be uploading a updated on the, on the, blah, 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 on the blah, credits glitch that doesn't require the MGMGB. So it's not so much gambling. It's actually get it every time glitch. So yeah, stay tuned. But if you like this video, make sure to leave a like and subscribe with noties on, and we'll see you in the next video. Peace.